What's up fellow content creators and streamers? Today I'm going to be reviewing a program called VideoProc. VideoProc has sponsored this video, but I still am going to give a honest review of it. But before we get into that, make sure you guys drop a like on this video, subscribe down below, and turn on that little notification bell. And other than that, let's get right into the video. So VideoProc is a one-stop video processing software. You can edit your videos, convert DVDs into MP4s or H.264 files, use it as a downloader, and also you can record your screen with it. One really big pro about this program is that it's fully GPU accelerated, which could be really helpful if you're trying to do something else on your computer. So this is the program. It's pretty user friendly, so you won't really have that many issues. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is video processing. It's really easy to do. So you just click on video and then you're just going to add a new video. And I'm just going to add one of my old Call of Duty clips because why not? And just like that, it was easily added. And so now you can do a bunch of different things. You can add different effects. You can change the brightness, contrast, hue, gamma, saturation. You can add subtitles if you want. And then of course you can cut the video. So like for an example, if I only want 20 seconds of the clip, all I have to do is just drag this down to the 20 second mark and then click cut. So now I can just click done. And now as you can see, it's only at 20 seconds. And then there's a bunch of different settings you can do for the quality, the video codec, the FPS, resolution, and pretty much everything you need. You're obviously not going to be able to do crazy editing like in Premiere Pro or After Effects, but if you want to do simple editing, just get the clip done and out there. You can just throw it in here and it will get it done just like that. For DVDs, if you want to convert it into a MP4 or something along those lines to have it on your computer instead of on a DVD, you can just add a disc to your computer and then you'll just choose the format that you want it in. Usually you'll just pick H.264, which is pretty much MP4, and then you'll run it and then pretty much you'll have a mp4 file on your computer so it has a video downloader as well so i'm just gonna i'm gonna test it out real quick so it says i can add any video or music so i'm just gonna copy the link from one of my older videos and then add it right here click analyze and then boom, just like that, easy. Um, it's giving me 1080p 60fps, which is the file that I uploaded pretty much. And then all I have to do is just click download selected files. And then to change where it's going to save the file, you can just browse down here. So I'm just going to click download now. Um, it's going pretty quick, already at 50%. Just like that, I have the video done. And here's the video. So as you guys can see, it's pretty good quality. I don't really see any issues or anything. So now you won't have to go to one of those low quality websites and get all those ad pop-ups and then only get like a 480p output. You can just go straight to video proc and download it from here and you'll get a nice crispy 1080p quality. And then finally, we have a screen recorder. So if you wanna only record your screen, you just click on screen. You can do your webcam or you can do a mixture of both. As you guys can see, it immediately picks up my camera. It's easy to scale up and down what you wanna look at. You can click which screen you wanna record down here. And then also you can select where it's gonna record. So you can crop down your screen or so. And then it's gonna have your audios down here. You can select which audio you wanted to record. And that's pretty much it. It's a pretty simple software to use. If you guys want to go check it out yourselves, the link will be down in the description below. There is a free download you can use so you can try it out before you actually buy it. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you haven't already, please be sure to drop a like and subscribe down below. And I'll be seeing you guys later. Peace out.